impressive. I don't even know why this is a question. Of course, it's the Miami Heat. I'm going to repeat what I said Saturday because maybe evidently people weren't listening. Barry Melrose, somebody. No hockey love. Excuse me. It was they, when it was 21 games. It was really an eight-game streak. There are three ties. I'm sorry, that doesn't count. I'm not into the tie business. This isn't soccer, okay? And 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 and, and, and the hockey stuff. I, I'm sorry, I'm not buying it. Not only that, if you go to the overtime, you get a point. If you win the game, you get a couple of points. But I'm sorry, you want a cookie? Last time I checked, when you get to take to the ice, it's to actually win. It's not to tie. So I don't get all of this stuff. Hockey clearly is about points because even if you go to overtime 20 times, you get 20 points. I don't understand it. As far as I'm concerned, you either win or you lose in sports. When the Stanley Cup champion is crowned, is it because of a tie? No, it's because of a win. So I don't want to hear anything about the greatest streaks and all of this other stuff. And by the way, uh, the other day when they asked me this question, Columbus, I wasn't even aware, Hannah, they had a Columbus uh, team in, in Columbus. <laughs> is that Columbus, George? Is it Columbus, Ohio? I mean, where is this team? <laughs> it's hockey we're talking about here. I respect the sport, but give me a break. In terms of the great winning streaks, there are ties in that record. I'm not buying it to my man Barry Melrose. Love you, though, boy. Love you. And the suits are looking better and better. But the tie <laughs> stuff just doesn't work for me. I'm sorry, ladies. It just doesn't. I think